Um, are, are we doing replays today? Are we? We're hoping we can get some replays as uh, bits happen. You never know. We might be lucky. We might not. We never know. Um, we will also keep you up to date with a certain game going on um, for the Binfield FC. That's got a couple of ex Slough Town players in their team at the moment, captained by James McClellan. He's based now, so we'll keep you uh, up to date with that as well. We're just waiting for our referee today to uh, sort this out. Nice to see a, a referee and officialing team under the age of 75 here at Arbour Park. And there you go, that is kick-off here at Arbour Park. And immediately Slough on the front foot, putting some pressure here on Zach Mitchell. Playing as a playmaker, looking for the ball here for Gabe George. Down this left-hand side, first touch in, plays it in, and the goalkeeper spilled it and makes a... Has it gone in? The referee says it hasn't. Somehow that ball didn't go in. And it's cleared by Njondo. Little one-two there with Burn. And Njondo has it uh, nicked off him there by... And again, that long ball there on the far-hand side. Finding Dan Roth. Played inside to the captain to tell Goof. Challenge comes in. He skips past that. Plays it in. Crosses it in. And George at the back post couldn't get the shot on target. Played in here towards where intercepted by Peg. Needs a bit of space. It comes here from Roth. Played inside. It comes through there. That's a great challenge in the end there uh, by Zach Mitchell. Ball back in, and uh, it wasn't collected by. <laughs> it's a shot by Gabe George. He hits uh, Powell and Beppe and goes out of play. And McNamara tries to get it going quickly with Dan Roth. Chipped in here, looking for the run of Joe Lowell. Who Directs his head wide of the goal and... It's Smedley with the kick. Straight down to uh, the goalkeeper, Michael Degby. It's going to try and get Slough on the attack quickly. Trying to look for the run of Joe Lowell. And Lowell gets there first in front of Smedley. Keeps the ball in. Turns, gets... Uh, Crossing, it's hooked clear only as far as Goof. He takes a shot, curls it just wide of the goal, and that's uh, bounced straight out of play. The throw comes in from George, looking for Beppe. Ball over top for Goof to chase. He goes for the glory shot and uh, finds the roof of the stand. And burn down the far hand side, trying to. Fine foul, a foul, a crosses, it's a deep cross and just catches in that crosswind. And Digby rolls it out quickly, finding Peck. Played inside here to Goof, who wins the first one, takes a touch pass to play inside towards Beppe. He does well to keep the ball in. And now he's up against Mitchell, goes for, oh, a curl it in, it in, it's either a cross come shot, needed a touch from either of the two players and just Hill on the far hand side. And, uh, oh, poor header back there by um, Scott Davis and Ware can't finish it. And in fact, it's uh, saved by Michael Ledegby. And Ledegby switches the ball over the top here for George, who's onside. Uh, up against Wint, plays it in first time and uh, the referee has blown for half time. Dan Roth has come short. And whips it in with a great cross and there's an offside against uh, Shawal who'd had the ball in the back of the net. But uh, the uh, linesman's flag straight up there. Play through here, Goof has stolen it off him inside here towards Lawal. Lawal trying to create some space again to Roth this first time. This time his cross isn't as good. Lawal tries to turn into the box, plays it across to Goof, who shoots, and it's uh, over the top and out of play. Corner. And it's played deep, it headed away there by Peg, only as far as 
and John Joe shoots. Oh, and it's a cracking goal from the number 11, Ryan and John Joe, from the edge of the area. They're straight across the goal. It didn't get a touch in Chippenham Town. Uh, lead on 53 minutes. And uh, the first real attack that uh, Chippen had in the second half has created a goal. And, uh, Scott Davis to take this free kick. Oh, just played it, we're looking for. Lowell, Lowell's onside, played it across, uh, and then it's held good if he's offside because he was too far in front. Second goal disallowed there for Slough. Goodby bringing the ball forwards here for Slough. Goof just leads the ball through towards Lowell. He's got uh, George on the outside. George has got a bit of space. What is it first time? Looking for Goof who can play it in towards Shewell, takes a shot, oh, and just tries to go for a, a curler. This ball finds Goff, just plays it on the right hand side to Dan Roth. First time ball for Lowell to chase. Lowell facing up to Hill, gets down the nearby side and just overruns it. Now to play for a goal kick. Scott Davis to take the free kick down the left-hand side for Gabe George. Hits it in hard and low. It's Elkins trying to go in. It looked like he was taken away. The referee and linesman don't say a foul. It's cleared by Chippenham Town up here towards uh, where and it's a slough through. With it's not a slough throw. <laughs> Played out here for George. First time ball. Finds the captain. Oh, played forwards here for Lowell. Lowell just muscled off the ball. Goal, he goes around it. Goes down. Um, I can't see how that isn't. Um, we're just going to have a look at the replay. That's got to be a penalty, surely. Lowell gets to the ball first. And it is a penalty. So uh, Slough with a chance to uh, get back in this game through their captain. So a chance here for Slough to equalise. It's Goff with the belt and he hits it into the back of the net, sends the goalkeeper the wrong way. And on 77 minutes, Slough get an equaliser. Oh, where it does really well. Turns still with the ball at his feet. He's going to go through a lot there. And in the end, a wall of yellow block the ball. And it's here with uh, Williams. He's got uh, Lowell on the outside if he can find him. Oh, he's just got taken out. The referee says, the referee says, play on. Oh, Goof does really well, turns away. He's got uh, Lowell on his outside. Going to try and go it alone and put the shot wide of the goal. There's, uh, Leach's head uh, clearance, it comes as far as Slough with uh, Williams. Williams trying to feed it through to Matowski. Heavy touch first time and fires it over. And again here with Kaiwin, crosses it in first time. Dan Roth stoops the head of the ball away. And uh, Slough's captain the goal scorer, loses the ball out there, tries to sneak it back, but uh, Smedley charging through and it's a free kick here for so it's burn with this free kick goes low oh and he scoops it into the net and uh, Chippenham have the lead again and again it's the same bottom corner that was found by John Joe with the goal And 
and uh, Slough trying to get the ball back. This is a bit heated over on the far hand side at the moment. And that will be the final whistle here at Arbour Park. It's finished Slough Town under 23s 1, Chippenham Town under 23s 2. All the goals coming in uh, the second half. First by Ryan and John Joe on 53 minutes for Chippenham Town. Equaliser the, from the penalty spot for Slough by their captain Itzel Goff. And then the winner coming on 88 minutes from a direct free kick from Nathan Byrne.